So now in the car I have the pleasure of having uh, Jerzy Buzek, the uh, former Prime Minister of Poland and uh, an MEP and the former President of the Euro European Parliament. I'm very glad to be in city Katowice. It's a capital of my home region. Excellent for COP24. Why? Because the main idea from black to green was developed in this city some years ago. And uh, it was even such a slogan. City Katowice, city of gardens. You cannot imagine in the middle of very industrial region, city of gardens. It does seem like something of a contradiction. Oh yeah, you were, yeah. You were, um... I can imagine. But well, from the point of view of COP24, mm -hmm. you should remember that everything what we are doing in COP24, all the conference center, right, big uh, cultural halls, everything is uh, on the same territory as an old mine. Mm -hmm. And everything was completely changed mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. to quite a new environment. So it's a fantastic example. It's possible to do. So we're seeing really a second wave of transition, if you will. Oh, yeah. um, we had the first one 25 years ago from the dark ages of communism and now, now we are transitioning into the Green Age and uh, a new, new fund has been created to help uh, local people transition into the green economy. How is that going to work? 20 years ago I had to introduce together with my government a big uh, coal mining industry restructurization and we closed in two, three years 22 coal mines without even one strike. Mm -hmm. Why? Why was it possible? How did that work? Yeah. Ah, yeah. Because we offered a social package. So you just mentioned uh, uh, new funds from the side of European Union. Mm -hmm. Absolutely necessary. Uh, I propose in European Parliament 5 billion euro mm -hmm. uh, in the next uh, financial perspective of the European Union. 5 billion euro mm -hmm. is of course not enough for coal regions in Europe, but it's an excellent sign to our citizens that we are with them, not against them. Mm -hmm. And you would like to help them in such a heavy time and difficult time uh, of transition. What are the build building blocks uh, to, to turn it from a black economy into a green economy? Coal, especially in uh, global scale, will do not disappear overnight. It takes time. From the Polish perspective, it's absolutely necessary to go out from coal. We have been doing a lot uh, uh, in the European Union and also in Poland let's say, since the beginning of this century, having more than 70 coal mines, now it's uh, something like 20. And uh, it, it will go step by step uh, uh, to in the same direction in the future. The, uh, the European Commission has uh, just uh, published the, uh, the new guidelines. We are going to turn into a net zero carbon uh, economy within the next three decades or so. Or so. In Paris Agreement, by mm -hmm. the way, it was in second half of 21st century, mm -hmm. and European Union proposal is just in mid 21st mm -hmm. century, so it's very ambitious goal. Mm -hmm. If we want to achieve it, first first issue is um, energy efficiency, as energy is the most important in the case of climate change. And we should uh, have uh, much higher use of renewables and end use efficiency. So heating, cooling, we should uh, go in this direction. Um, uh, district heating, for example. And the most important today and for COP24 is convince the others because European Union is not enough. We are responsible for 10% of CO2 emission uh, uh, on our planet. So if you want to survive with our planet. We're driving around your, your home city. Oh yeah. Uh, you talk to the local people. What are they saying? What is their, what are their primary concerns when it comes to climate change? Well, um, maybe that was not so popular uh, years or some even some months ago. But now 
thanks to COP24, it could be more and more popular. This this conference coming to town has been a very very good thing. Yeah, consciousness yeah. building on a, like on yeah, that yeah, that sort of level. Yeah, of course, of course. What is uh, your climate message to the world? <clears throat> the most important uh, to have a global agreement, and um, we cannot survive with our planet for the long term perspective if uh, we do not agree on the Katowice package. Main message to all the politicians being in Katowice today and for the next uh, five days to finish with a great agreement, Katowice package. There is a picture of a child up there on, yeah. a, on a billboard. If you stood in front of this kid right now and you had 10 seconds to explain to him what you're doing uh, in Katowice with everyone gathered here, the 20 odd thousand people. What is the main message that you want that kid to walk away with? To take care of all the greens around, uh, to change our habits, not to use uh, energy, water, everything what is around uh, in such a way like it was uh, uh, some years ago. A lot of important issues which uh, could be explained to to, to Chetur. Very well. Jerzy Bozek, it's been a real pleasure. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot.